Hi, I'm Dave. I'm here with Fifth Element Machine today. I'm here to demonstrate one of our new product lines, the adjustable tail stock stopper for this TL2. Anyone who has these machines know that you can run into a lot of problems with having extended quill lengths. So today we're going to demonstrate a problem that you could possibly run into. The machine is made with 4 inch bed slots to lock the tailstock in place when machining a part. So if you could see here, if I wanted to theoretically cut this thread on this part, I can't get the tailstock quite up to the furthest bed slot, which means I would have to lock it back here and extend the quill way out here significantly compromising my strength and rigidity so through using this machine we've come up with a product to fix this so now we can simply suck the quill up as tight as we can keep everything nice and rigid and insert the adjustable fifth element tailstock stop. So this goes right into the bed slot to the machine. It's fully adjustable, quarter inch increments. Tighten it down. Now we can lock the tailstock up. We're nice and tight and rigid and we fix our problem. Now we're going to take a closer look at the adjustable tailstock stop. You can see it weighs about 10 pounds. It's made out of aluminum and steel pins. It's got some handles so it's real easy to maneuver in into place. So when you use it, you can just set it where you need it. Bring your tailstock up to it. And then adjustments, just loosen the knob. Each click is a quarter inch. And lock it down. The splines have about uh, 30 foul of engagement, which is very strong. It's not going to displace or move once you lock it in. We use this tool to support the tailstock when face driving. So if you're doing uh, tailstock operations with different length tools, a lot of the problem here again is you have a 4 inch bed slot spacing with a 5 inch quill uh, stroke. And a lot of times with different length tools, you're either too close or too far away, you just can't get there. You know, you may be you may need to be like right there and there's no bed slot. So it's a real simple thing to just pop this thing over, come in behind the tailstock, and then lock it down. And then for the next tool, you may have to pull it back an inch. No tools required, it's everything you need is right here behind the tailstock. that long reamer, you know, we may do something like that. Bring it back four or five inches and then ream our hole. So this is one of the products we came up with to help, uh, help the users that have purchased this machine and along with some other stuff, check them out on our website, fifthelementmachine.com. Thanks for watching.